Good afternoon, Mr. Smith. Hi, my name is John. I'm going to be your PCA this evening, and right now what we're going to do is we're going to help you to get washed up, okay? Just give me a moment and I'll get everything together. I wash my hands. I provide privacy for the patient. I will go to the clean supply area and gather all of my supplies. And then I'm going to pour the bath. I want to feel that myself, make sure it's a comfortable temperature. Now, Mr. Smith, you just check this water real quick and make sure that it's comfortable for you. Is that okay? Okay, good, good. Now, get this all together here. Now, what we're going to do is we're going to remove this dirty gown that you have on. And we want to make sure to keep the, the patient covered as much as possible for his own privacy purposes. Just the same as before, we're going to push the gown across the body so that we can keep him covered. And come over here to the other side. And remove the gown. this up and of course keep it away from your uniform so as not to become more contaminated than necessary. Place that in your soiled linens container. I'll come back over and we're going to don our PPE standard precaution with a pair of gloves. And one of the first things that we're going to start with during this bathing process is with the face. We'll wet our first washcloth. And when we're doing this, because it is the face and it is sensitive, we will not apply any soap to this. Wet your washcloth, bring it out so that it is comfortable. And an easy technique to use, considering that you have to change the surface every time, is go for a four corners. And you begin with the eyes. You close your eyes, sir. You start from the inside and wipe out. And then make sure that every time that you wipe, you change the surface of your washcloth. There you go. Then around the edge of the face. Other edge of the face. And then you can open it up, flip it over, and begin the process again. Pour the inside of the cheek and out. the cheek and then make sure that you get the bridge of the nose. Dispose of your first washcloth and then using a putting technique dry the patient's face. Now, we're going to wash one arm, so you just want to uncover the necessary portion of your patient so that you maintain that privacy. And you can use the same towel underneath the arm. If you raise this up, we'll just place this right up here. Grab a, another washcloth, get that wet. And for this, you will apply soap. Get that worked in. And then you can use the same four quarter technique for the arm. You want to make sure to support it and wash on the outside. And again, make sure that you use a new surface every time that you wipe your patient.
across the top of the hand. And the palm. And then you want to make sure to get every finger individually. So that is clean as well. Okay. When done, dispose of that washcloth and your soiled linen is here. And grab another washcloth. Repeat the same pattern with a washcloth without soap to rinse off the soap. Dispose of that washcloth back in your linen container. And you can use that towel and you can fold it over the arm and pat dry all wet surfaces. Making sure to get in between each finger. One of the easiest ways to do this, I'm going to treat this kind of like Superman, sir. And what we're going to do is just reach forward and put your arms through those. There you go. And wrap it around. Still maintaining as much privacy as you can for the patient. So you lay the gown over the top and pull the blankets down. And you can bring that back up and over. Alright, you comfortable? I get all this cleaned up. So, into your basin. Make sure to rinse that out well and dry it. area along with the soap. And all of your linens into the soiled linens container. Remove your gloves. I wash my hands. I want to come back over to the patient, make sure they're all right. Make sure the bed is in the low position. Mr. Smith, right there on your left, you have your call light. If you need anything, you just press that button. We'll be down here to help you, okay? And then I wash my hands again, and I am done. <laughs>